And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for a special Rank Up Sunday stream. What we're going to do here today is something that I actually haven't uh, done before at all, is we're going to play one deck for uh, like all day and try to rank up as much as we can with it. It's a deck that I'm really confident in right now, Lucian Fury. We played it for a 5-0 just the other day. Um, and uh, I've been playing it off stream also to a lot of success. I think the deck's really, really strong. It has good rates on so many attacking uh, units and also has, um, has some challenger in here to help us win combat and just a really strong deck. You know, the, has two awesome one drops, maybe the two best one drops in the game with Fleet Feather Tracker and Omen Hawk. And then really good two drops lucian war chefs like these are just great two drops um you know nothing wrong with bright seal protector either and so you get to you get to uh, get out ahead early um and then you and then three mana slot you have a really good defensive card with with protege and really good offensive cards with duelist and senna and then finishes with like the best six drops in the game scythria sejuani so just good cards all across the curve so yeah so how this is going to work um yeah, it's yeah. This is yeah. This is a mid-range Demacia deck, um, you know, just just like you know, very, very much classic Demacia, um, using Freljord for some important cards. A great one drop with Omen Hawk, in my opinion, the best champion in the game with Sejuani at the top end, and then an awesome, awesome pump spell with Fury of the North um, that help finishes games out as well. Um, uh, yeah, I mean. I, it, each person's different. So as far as like recommending this over Heimer Vi for or Deep for myself, absolutely. Like that's what that's what I'm going to be doing. I I much prefer this over the other two. But each person each person's different. Each player's different. So um, yeah, but for, yeah, I I recommend this myself. All right. So you can see we're starting at rank um, 477 is where we're starting today off at. We're going to see how high we can get. Um, you know, just playing this deck today. I'll probably break this into, so it's not just one uh, long five hour video. I'll probably break it into three videos for those y'all on YouTube. You know, we'll do like, uh, we'll just play games to about like an hour and 20 minutes or so, hour 15, something like that. And then, uh, you know, then I'll start the second video and, and things like that. Okay, so we're playing against Sejuani, Misfortune. We're going to get rid of these two. I don't know, Duelist could actually be good. But I'll just keep keep these. I really want one mana card. Yuck. No one mana cards there. Lucky. I wish I had a Nomen Hawk. Maybe should have mulliganed the Senna also. Basically, just want like there's four cards that you really want in your opening hand, and the rest of them are kind of meh. Opening hand, I just want I want Flea Feather Tracker, I want Omen Hawk, um, I want War Chefs, and I want Lucian. I want those four. Like I'll still keep Bright Steel Protector because it's a two drop, and sometimes I'll keep Senna if I, you know, like. Those are like the only, those are like the other two. And then I guess like maybe keep Protege if I'm mulliganing everything else or if I have a good one, two, three already. I've always got your back. Don't worry about me. Not so fast. Hmm. Love ya. Yes, I would mull or I would uh, level up Lucian. I've always got your back. Don't worry about me. With that, but these are just such better attackers than trading with an Omen Hawk. And I'm going Senna over the four mana cards because I want to have single combat available as a trick. All 
Alright, attacking like this. I, I like putting Lucian before Senna because they want to kill Lucian. So if they kill Lucian, then these have double attack. Um, you know, like if they, you know, had block and frostbite or something. Where if we do Lucian last, they can just like take the hits for four easily and then, then kill the Lucian afterwards. Yeah, so something like this. So this would give uh, these things double attack. Um, Credit denied. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to have this fight this. I should I should have just done the one that it's Oh no 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 yeah no never mind this works okay. So now we level up Lucian. Yeah, yeah, that works, that works okay. I mean I I mean this is this is my favorite deck right here, Parak. This is, the question was what do you think is the best deck in the meta besides Heimer Vi? This is this is my pick right here. How's the I know the board music is louder in this this board. And so I did um, I did turn the board music down. But what do y'all think? If it's if you think it's too loud, you know, just let me know. Could be just still just be a little bit lower, but not much, okay? All right, I'm not sure if that makes... Yeah, we'll see if that uh, helps. Let's see. Break their spirits and their swords. You call this a fight? Aha. My gun does the talking. Go ahead, scare me. So this will be Protégé dying, which means I get another attack step. Which is why I went with Protégé instead of uh, like one of these other things last turn, even though I could have done one of these four mana cards with Omen Hawk, but went Protégé because then we could challenge this and make sure it dies. Get ahead of yourself. Those both hit Senna. And this, that's just gonna kill everything. Wow. That was a good turn for them. Like that's that's a great make it rain. I mean, make it interesting for me. I'll be damned. No room for doubt. That was a great maker. Yeah, that was that was perfect. And both hitting Senna. Otherwise, this game would have been over. Only the strong survive. Yeah, if, if just one, if only one of those hit Senna, this game was over. I think they may win this now. They have warning shot to back up a leveled up Sejuani. Right 
No, I mean, I I can't get to rank 1 from rank 477 in 5 hours. It's, that's not possible. But I'm going to try to rank up as much as we can today. Oh yeah, Sejuani is definitely broken. I mean, I'm playing Sejuani. I think it's the best... I mean, it's probably the best just straight-up card in the game. Hey, what's up, Stroke? Thanks for the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you. All right, let's miss some food I appreciate stuff. that. Be the Why is this animation so slow? They do three cannon shots for each one of those, which is really unnecessary. Not a good block, right? Right, just block with the seven four. Born for conquest. Dash it up. Fight like the animal you are. The third Fury of the North. Oh well. Uh, double Mega Rain won it for him. Well, that obviously, and then Sejuani. Alright, so 590. Well, that's gonna set us back. <laughs> Thanks, Valiant. Well, thank you, Stroke. It says, I love the YouTube videos. Figured I'd come support you here, too. That's really nice. Thank you. All right, good. Not facing Misfortune. Or, sorry. Sorry. We are facing Misfortune again, but sorry. Uh, not facing Sejuani. There we go. Uh, get rid of that. Um, I'm not keeping two, three drops. Could just mulligan them both. Or I could keep one. So keep Senna. Oh my gosh. What are these mulligans today? Okay, at least we get the tracker. <laughs> what is that? Hey, what's up, Giga? Turkey? What's up, y'all? Oh no! Bright Seal Protector. Got punished for blocking. You know, I could have gone Bright Seal Protector with the Challenger. And eaten something for free. So, if, like, their next card's Misfortune. They don't get, like, a free attack with the 3-1. If they play Misfortune, they have to attack in with it. Um I'm what nightmares fear. Fresh out of mercy. Stand down. Mwah. Yeah, we're playing some Lucian Fury right now. Yep. Hell of a day. Hey Mr. Q, doing good? How are you doing? Making the dead deader. 
I want a challenger before I play this protector, or at least or play the protector on defense. That's a good draw. If I play this, I definitely have like the six drop to play next turn. Or I play War Chef Senna and the next turn have like Bjerg Protector. I want six drop. Zwani's too good. Yeah, Scrub Lord, we were doing a rank up stream today. I think first first time I've ever really done a rank up stream. Uh it hasn't Hasn't gone swimmingly so far. We've only just played the one game. And it looked like we were going to win, but then double make it rain. Both of them hit my Senna. Oh, come on. They stole one card. They stole Scythria. Really? Wow. The absolute best card for them to take. I have two Scythrias in the deck. Literally the best card to take. Wow. Leave no survivors. I guess there's no real reason to, to block that thing over this thing. Makes Sejuani so good. Basically, the rate, it's. She's just such a big champion, especially with Freljord's ability to make their champions bigger with a wide variety of things, such as Omen Hawk. Makes sense though. A deck that I've just been winning with so much, I go and, and try to do this this rank up thing, so then I immediately just lose. That makes sense. But yeah, Sejuani has overwhelm, can just dominate combat. Um, yeah, it's just a really good card. Just gotta do exclamation point deck. For the deck list. My first 23 games of this deck, I was 21 and 2, and now we're 0 and 2. So, you know, you just have to, you know, it just evens out kind of thing. What are these hands? Get rid of all this stuff. There we go. We actually have one drop, two drop. Yeah, of course, Mr. Mr. Cressidos, of course. Quesitos. Lady Elise, please take me home. Hush, my sweet. It'll be over soon. Let us 
settle this with grace and civility. Yeah, the Grizzled Rangers, this game. There you are. That's a great card. That's just, that's a great card. Attacking with the two one over the one one. I guess they eat the two one. All right, well we're behind. Not something that happens very often. Would have loved to have you last turn, Bright Seal Protector. Thanks for nothing. No, I'm not going to be playing any such Wani Swain today. We're going to be playing this this deck here. I mean, at least that's my plan. Who knows, maybe I get tired of it or something. <laughs> we just... We do uh, lose all our games. You never know. Yeah, turn 6, 10, 10, Endure. Pretty awesome. Yeah, yes. Um, donation decks are $10. Yep, I will play it tomorrow for Meme Tier Monday if you'd like. And that's the link right there. Yeah, yeah, I'm up. And no, I can't beat Atrocity, obviously. I can't beat another They Who Endure either. Is this a good attack with this thing where they get to block with sentry? And then it turns into a 3-4. Maybe not, actually. I just have too many Grizzled Rangers. Crazy. More games I've ever lost this with this deck. And we're gonna lose that many in a row. No close 
Of course I'm happy about new game modes and regions coming. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. More... Yeah, I don't... I don't know how you couldn't be happy about that. Like, of course. Why would someone be upset about new game modes and um, things? But I'm sorry, I'm kind of snappy. I'm not happy about how this is going, of course. Um. <laughs> I, I haven't lost three games of this deck at all yet, and now we just lost three in a row. This is... I guess this shows that I shouldn't do this ever again. This whole rank up thing, I guess. Wow, we actually have the cards that we want in our opening hand. How about that? That's nice. So we're going to play... How do we want to do this? We can go... Omen on one. Yeah, I think we can keep all of these. Sometimes, sometimes I'll mulligan a one drop, like if I if I'm not gonna play it for a while. But we're gonna play all these here. Hey, there we go. I don't know what is wrong with that that notification thing. That that was weird. Um, but awesome. All right, so I'll go I'll go read that message here real quick. I was worried about Jagged Butcher. That was the, you know, obviously I didn't really want to see Jagged Butcher, but... Let's get to it. Oh well. Hey man, big fan. I watch you every day and enjoy your content a lot. Mad respect for you and your content. That's awesome. Please continue in your thing and enlighten us. And then we got a donation deck for Meme Tier Monday. Awesome. Awesome, yep, I will play that tomorrow. How is this only plus two? Oh, they stole my thing that was plus three, plus three? Or no, 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 they stole something that was plus two, plus two, and then this was the next thing that was plus two, plus two. Okay, so that's how that happened. Okay. Who does not know the name Laurent? But yeah, they... So yeah, they stole plus two plus two thing. Looking for trouble. It found you. Dangerous water. Should have made that block on turn to... It's 
Grizzled Ranger's hitting hard. Really need to attack with these Omen Hawks. These Omen Hawks could be good threats with the Fury of the Norse later. All right, so they're going to be able to level up Misfortune. killing them next turn. I really don't want to see Sejuani. I really just don't want to see Sejuani this turn. I guess my better play is... I guess that's a pretty good play. Because this deck's amazing, only love. Bef I was 21-2 and two with this deck. <laughs> Before today... I'm just 0 and 3 today. It's just Pain is not my opponents keep on having the best things they can. Like I said, just don't want to see Sejuani. Anything else, we we win just fine. All eyes on me. So no real sense in using a Fury of the North here. Just let this Grizzled Ranger die. Really glad they don't have leveled up Sejuani. Hmm. Do I use Fury of Fury of the North? I do. Let's see. I pull this. They go block, block. They take three, four, five, six, and then plus the set three, seven, eight, nine. So they would take nine. Um, I could have some other kind of removal. I 
I guess 10. They're taking 10. Make it interesting for me. I could challenge, because they have to block the six and the five, or the six and the seven. I guess I could just challenge this. Those things have to block six and seven anyway. But if they have, this is worse if they have removal for like one of these and then Sejuani can block something over here. Prove your worth. Don't get ahead of yourself. So 10. Uh, yeah, how can you sub? Um, follow... Nope, not that. Okay, that doesn't work either. There should be a, a sub link. Um, GG's, alright, we're on the board. Top right hand corner. If you know, if you're on, um, if you're on desktop, it's a top top right hand corner. There's a button that says subscribe. It's like right above the video. All right, seven sixty. We got some, we got some making up to do. I guess it may be underneath the video. It should be. I'm gonna try to get the link for you though. Man, Sejuani misfortune everywhere. We'll play against different things. Tracker. Alright, Scrub Lord. Twisted Fate Jinx. Okay. Got a donation deck there for Twisted Fate Jinx. Thank you. We'll play that on Tuesday. Because, you know, we got meme tier Monday tomorrow. Cool. Thanks, Scrub Lord. Get bloody, get paid. Um. All right, I think I think this is the sub link. If anybody wants to try that out, I think that's a, a sub link. And if so, I'll I'll make that the command. Okay, that works. Okay. Let's get to it. You point, I shoot. Okay, got some commands now. start. It's always a lot easier when you have your one drop on turn one. Alright, 
Oh. Let's do that. Fortune favors the bold. The ocean is no place for the weak. Yeah, I mean, Misfortune Sejuani does look pretty strong when you always have this kind of curve. Like, they only have one one drop. They keep on having that. They always have Misfortune. Um, yeah, like, they, they they have their best cards at every every time, all three games. I have not, like, you know, if you think I, like, they always have, like, the Jagged Butcher turn one. I haven't had Fleet Feather Tracker at all turn one. I guess I could have played it the, the turn one previously, though. I don't want to do this. Do I want to Fury? I'm doing on the Grizzled Ranger, not the Protégé, because my Grizzled Ranger can block twice. Like, this is still taking three damage. Um, and then, so it'll have two health, so I can block again with something else, and then I'll still have the three, four. Love ya. But getting that out of there is, uh, you know, nice, because getting a scout out of there for Misfortune, but also it's their four health um, thing for defense. Like, if they don't attack, my Grizzled Ranger can attack back. So why would you time the, that Misfortune trigger right then? Oh, because you hit the Grizzled Rangers and then it doesn't do damage. Right, right, right. Okay. I was thinking... Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Alright, so yeah, that makes sense. Pain is nothing. So their plan's Fury of the North. Fury of the North kills my kills this thing. So I guess I go this way so Fury of the North doesn't kill. But then Sejuani's not a good blocker. I still have the Badger Bear that's a good blocker, though. Single combat, that's a good card. We have we have three of those. Maybe we'll draw that card. Maybe we'll draw single combat. The dead don't need riches. So the barrier eats the misfortune trigger, and then it'd be a 3-4 to be able to eat either of those. And then we can have the 3-2 trade with the other. Up there in the 
Alright, no misfortune attack. I wish I had I wish I had room for Lucian and Sejuani. Yeah, I think Fury of the North is their only protection spell. They've just had it all the time. Alright, well now we have room for Lucian. No! Ugh, I needed that tracker to kill Misfortune. Oh, man. Keep getting <laughs> these mega rings. Ugh. I honestly, so yeah, Volrin. I don't know what, what like the best deck is to start off with. It used to be the the you know like whenever you're first getting into Rune Terra. It, it used to, like it was a, a few months ago. I, I just don't really know after after the new set came out. Um, but it used to be the um, Spider Aggro with Elise and Darius. Um, that was the best like starter deck and uh, best one to kind of go after, you know, kind of um, work with. Soldier, to me. So I'm not, I'm not sure if it's still that. Might as well do it with the three one, not the four one. <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, if you yeah go B Bannerman Demacia, yeah, absolutely. I know on uh, on um, Mobilytics, the website. Um, that I used to put all my decks up, that, that website there. If you go to the left-hand side, there's the Deck Library tab. And if you click on that, there's an option for Budget. And you can click on the Budget um, tab and kind of uh, browse through there. There's, like, some starter upgrades and stuff that, like, Swim made and, and things like that. So maybe that, that can also help out.
game's pretty even right now. I could definitely see us losing. I think they, I think we would have definitely had it. Uh, yeah, that was the, that's what I was worried about with Sejuani. Now we're very far behind. I think we would have had it if if they did not have that make it rain with that last two mana that make it rain and hit the track the fleet feather tracker. I think we would we won this game. Um, but you know, like just just having that like forced me to use my fury of the north and kept their misfortune alive, like all sorts of stuff, just because of that. Mage Explosive. This is frustrating. Hey, what's up there? So, how, how am I supposed to pronounce your name? Is it Il Biz? Is that how I pronounce your name? Thank you so much for the tier one sub. Oh yeah, ever yeah, I mean Nothing escapes. It's certainly been going my opponent's way. Okay, it's an Arab thing. Cool. So we get Sejuani again. Sejuani really good. Who does not know the name Laurent? Okay. Gotcha. Um Well, yeah. Thank you so much. Okay, right, so I'll just go with I'll just go with Biz. If that's okay. I guess that's not the correct correct pronunciation. Fight the signal fires. Sharpen the blades. Cure the kill. I guess used, made him use another frostbite spell. <clears throat> Protege stays alive. Making the day deader. So we'll have we'll just go send Illusion this turn. And we could follow it up with having Glory Seeker challenge Lucian. They're out there. In a world full of monsters, I'm glad I have you. 
Of course, they could also just have Frostbite cards. Now they'll probably be challenging the Senna. Which I can't quite stop right now. Alright, that happens. Okay, the question is if we want to just go Sejuani on their turn and we don't get the access to the Frostbite and Vulnerable, or maybe we go like Beard plus Lucian. Let's go Beard plus Lucian. Hopefully draw... Okay. I was going to say I wouldn't mind drawing another Sejuani, honestly. Correct. No, because... Yeah, you, you cannot... Once you're in Master Rank, you can't leave Master Rank. You just get a lower and lower number. Or I guess technically a higher and higher number. Um, if when you lose... Hopefully no Sejuani over there. Hopefully no Sejuani over there. Okay, good. No Sejuani. Okay, so we can have you challenge you. And... Four damage on there. It's really a difference between four and three as far as damage goes. Not really. We'll get the extra. You know, so I could basically I could have had the hearth guard at one health and them at eleven, or the hearth guard at two health and them at. 12. Ten. Just kind of want the tricks right now, you know, like we haven't seen single combat. Like that, or... I did play Fury of the North already. Trifarian. Show them what we're made of. So can we kill them through through harsh winds? Harsh winds is going to be a problem. Ugh, we're reckoning. Also a problem. No, I don't want any more spells in the deck. I know there are very few spells, but that's uh, that's a good thing, I think. You don't want the spells till the late game. You don't want like your hand in the early game just to have a whole bunch of spells on it in it. Let's see, I guess that makes a 4-4. Four, four. Could challenge this. So that they can't just kill my 4-4. Four, four.
Okay. So they lose everything. I lose the middle two. I don't hardly level up Sejuani in this deck, but it looks like we're going to level up Sejuani this time. I don't know. Never been strong enough. Strength and grace, beauty in the play. I need just a moment. That's not good. That's not good. Six two glory seeker. either. <laughs> it's a bunch of not good. That gets them closer, you know, gets them just closer to having harsh winds. No attacks. No attacks past turn. No attacks. Fast turn. Fast turn. Fast turn. <laughs> they figured out there's just no reason for... There we go. There's no reason for the Glory Seeker not to attack. Best card in the opening hand, worst card. I guess trackers may be a little bit better. The worst card to draw late. You would be right to fear me. I demand satisfaction. Aha. Can't fight on an empty stomach. Just hoping they don't have frostbite cards. No, I haven't I haven't done in tournament stuff with this game. Alright, so they definitely have frostbite cards. Looks like we're gonna lose. I, I'll be shocked if we win, because they have you know, if they just have harsh wins, this game's over. Looks like that's what they got. Crystal arrow. Right or no? That's not sixteen damage, it's twenty one. Close to sixteen. Stronger. 
Well, this has been a nightmare day. Nightmare. Our only win was the game that we had one drops. <laughs> we had a, we have not had one drops all these other games. I I love when we just don't get paired against Sejuani. Sejuani is, I mean that's that's just also how we've lost ever, uh, you know like it's Sejuani is just amazing. So when we have Sejuani and opponent doesn't, that is great. One drop. Spell that a bite to cook it. You can see the Nebastian border from here. Like, I just want to play against, like, Vimerdinger. <laughs> Anything without Sejuani. Time for a true display of skill. Card's good. Alright, we could use a challenger. One shot, all skill. I guess there's not really. Yeah, we, we don't we won't have the mana for. Yeah, we can't we can't kill this thing anyway. So I wanted to. I didn't play the Bright Seal Protector first because I wanted to play Babbling Bjerg this turn. This turned into another ugly hand. We kept these three two drops. We've drawn four, four, six, six. And then we just played another fours. So we've drawn three fours and two sixes. So yeah, I'll start Mystic Shotting my stuff. Just how it goes. Alright, so they rummaged away the fake Mystic Shot to cast a real Mystic Shot. You know, the generated one. You own what you take. No Sejuani. No Sejuani, no Sejuani. So that was an Ezreal's Mystic Shot that they just cast. So that means they have two Ezreal's in the deck. So we know they have one Jinx, one Trindamir, one Sejuani, so that they have either either they have three Ezreal's or they have one of or they have two of some of those. That just that means they don't have three Sejuani, so that's good. For the home 
I should play stuff pre-combat. Who would face me? I don't know. Pain is nothing. Okay. Jack was a little janky. We survive. But we can use that. All right, let's play one more, and then we'll switch to our second video. The first video didn't didn't go so well. We're gonna play one more. Yeah, that was a weird deck. That is something that you, that happens sometimes. Sometimes whenever whenever people get to master rank, then they just start playing crazy stuff because they're already in masters and can't go down. that happens. The first time we played turn one Fleet Feather Tracker. It's our eighth game. <laughs> hey, a single combat. Don't have that card too often either. No, you cannot derank from masters. It's just it's just like your number goes down. You can't derank from anything. You know, like once you're gold, you can't derank back to silver. You know, once you're diamond, you don't go back to um, platinum. You you can't derank. Strength and grace, beauty in the play. You can go, like, basically, you can fall down to, like, gold four, right? Like, if you're gold one, you can go down to gold four, but you don't, you can't go, you can't lose a rank. All right, Mr. Q. Good luck in your tournament. Take care. up friend 43 tracker one banner one destiny hmm So what's their Freljord card? Fury of the North or Omen Hawk? I guess we've seen we've seen Omen Hawk, right? Is that their Freljord card? Like, do they have? I wonder if they have Fury of the North or not. Sentinels of light don't fear the dark. You're covered. 
Ah, uh, that's annoying. It is annoying. How'd you beat me here? A lady has her secrets. Okay, yeah, it was Omen Hawk. Head to the base. Harry, repost, positive, fair. Purity and peace. My gun does the talk. No one goes hungry. No closer. So basically, they did have like a Fury of the North or Repost, something like that. Like they were going to block, kill my Lucian, then we'd have the double strike Senna. Eight eight Sithria is going to be tough. I'll sleep when they're dead. Dang. Those are two great cards to have left. That's pretty great. So I want to save Lucian. Come on. Alright. This is ridiculous. We must not relent. You'll pay for this. Ridiculous. Alright, so anyway, so that's how it goes. So we went uh, two and six with our first video. Um, we're gonna try again though. So we're gonna run it back and try again. This uh, rank up day has just been a nightmare so far. Um, yeah, this is not how I envisioned this stream going. So I'm sorry about that, but um, it's not over yet. So 
that's our first part. Um, yeah, as I talked about at the beginning, we're splitting it into the three parts for YouTube. Um, we'll come back and try to do better. You know, try to get just try to get a little bit more luck. Um, yeah. All right. Anyway, there's Lucian Fury. Unreal two and six. All right. Anyway, uh, y'all watch on YouTube. Thank you so much for watching. Um, let me know in the comments if you like this idea of trying a rank up day every once in a while. This isn't something that I'd even do once a week, like maybe once a month kind of thing, like that that kind of thing. But um, yeah, so far not working out. But all right. Anyway, thanks for watching again, and I'll see you for the next video.